So they work hopefully? I feel that. It's been wildly busy at my work lately, so definitely relatable there. Ow. Nice to win round one against a uh, Heptastar. Alright. What are we thinking here? Yeah, it's been crazy at my job since uh, basically the beginning of December. It's been busy, busy, busy. How down am I to low tempo this? I'm kind of down. Or we could just do this. Break through. But I kind of want another turn of rolling on one. See if we can upgrade the Vigorous Force at all. Yeah. We'll low tempo this. I'm down. The early rounds you don't lose too much HP on, or destiny on. She runs out of cheese, so that's nice. Do we actually win this? No, we don't. If we put any more effort into the board, we would've. Definitely win if we just pop the shuttle orchids. That's kind of funny. So many of the plants. Interesting. Not quite what I want to be doing, but interesting. I want another vigorous force. Another vigorous force. Okay. I can work with that. <laughs> um, honestly, kind of down for just regenerating body. Exercising is good. I think we're going to keep up pretty well off of just regenerating body here. We could start giving him the chop. I did not want you to high roll that. Actually, I really, 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 really wish that that just wasn't a max roll. Unfortunate. That not being a max roll would have been nice. Aha! I have this now! Otherwise, I'll explain it in uh, voice in a moment. Just let me go through this turn real quick. We're rolling again, not now. We're going to roll again on... I just don't want to take engine damage, right? I don't need to pop a ton here. I just need to pop a little.
Yeah, Genshin damage is enough for me to want to do that. So yeah, force is essentially um, all of your attacks deal 10% more damage per stack of force, um, and then spend a charge of force. So if we were at like 4 force, our attack would deal 40% increased damage, and then we'd go down to 3 force. I may have popped more than I needed here. I just really didn't want to take Yanshin damage. That's fine. Alright, we have some good hits on three again. I think we roll down here. Can be good. <clears throat> playing against top board in the lobby. Playing against top board is a good reason to pop this. I'm fine. Oh, well, this is. No, it won't. It won't do that. Right. It's not a cost. Pretty sure that's how this works. Our physique is at 27. And that does not spin. Perfect. Damn, you need to stop hitting upgrades. I need you to not kill me here. I need you to not kill me here. Thank you. Thank you. Bone day. Love bone day. Justic Chi as well. Very, very cool. Um... for this even. We're getting four physique out of that. Slightly behind curve, so I do need... Well... That'll work. Maybe this was a divine power angle, but I don't think so. So hard. Yeah, I'm I'm really enjoying this mid game. Uh, I think it's just gotta be full of force here, right? If we're just trying to win the lobby. Otherwise, undying body is always good, but full of force looks great here. We do want to greed a bit to five, but. Well, I mean, our phone's board right now sucks. Pop both these and win and greed. Why am I? Oh, okay. I thought that was a 30. I'm like, how am I tied on cultivation with the long out here? I should just punch through this defense, right? I hope. Like we stay ahead enough. 
probably didn't need to pop both, but that's fine. Better safe than sorry. Like there's such a good side job. It is a really, really good side job, but it's also very, very complicated to play. Again, our opponent is pretty weak here. I think we're good to just keep grading. This is not a very strong board, but our opponents aren't challenging us. Um, I guess we get Ghost Howling here, right? Just really... We have the G for it. Might even go first, because he's super slow for some reason. Do I want to need to move back? Kind of, but I also want to make sure I'm hitting my physique cap every turn. If we miss a turn of Tindies, we mess up our future uh, turns pretty badly. If I were to deal more damage, though, yes. Nice 80 watch streak, Zygon. Winning that. That's okay. We're we're greeting a little bit right now. We're getting one four. If we if we're hitting the exercise fist, I guess we don't need that. Never going first here. That's fine. We are greeting. We're on the perfect curve for our breakthrough to five with all of our rolls. I'm pretty happy with this. Credit is I will never play Plant Master again. It's just so good for this faction, and I need to learn it. I can't be a wimp forever. Oh my god. That is so much damage, Yari. How do you have all of that already? Four copies of Water Spirit Formation, four copies of Turbulent, three copies of Great Waves. Yikes! Yikes! I don't like that one bit. Why'd we... Oh, because we're playing her. Right, right, right. That's why we overcapped on rolls. Anyways, we break through here. Uh, next turn, which is nice. We're at two higher speed than it shows. I don't think we're ever winning, but... That sounds agonizing. Just the thought of that made me anxious. Man, we lose the coin flip as well. I even ate a flower for that. I didn't expect her to go full cultivation against uh, physique build. Maybe she just hit a bunch of upgrades. Oh well. 
Oh, this didn't go great. Well, that's interesting. Okay, one moment of thinking. Crash foot works. Not really what I'm looking for right now, but cool. I don't know. I I guess this is a thing. Cards. Damage. Damage, please. Damage, please. Damage, please. Need cards that deal damage. I do need cards that deal damage, please. I actually need cards that deal damage. Whatever, that'll work. That'll work as a finisher. We have a maxed crash footwork. But, um... We unfortunately don't have our force payout. Tiers 1 through 3 felt good, tier 4 felt terrible, tier 5 roll down feels terrible. We're at Forest Cap. It's a lot of damage. I need another one. You'll be maxed out next turn. Space Spiritual goes in pretty easily. Mighty Force versus Ghost Howling. We currently have three, two. Don't need the ghost howling. Well, ghost howling or soul cleaving. Mighty Force doesn't see play here, I'm pretty sure. That's the one that goes. Um, I don't really have room for the crane footwork in this build. As good of a card as it is, I just don't really have room for it. Urging Waves is great. He's going first, so he's going to get the stun off, but I think we're still just going to kill him. I think this is fine. That's a lot of damage. I don't know if we even need the Vigorous Force in here. I think we want it. Pretty high base damage. By the time we're playing it, we're on... We start off on 2 Force. Yeah, it's gotta be worth it. By the time we're playing it, we're at like 9 Force, so it's 18 base, yeah. Ooh, I hope you didn't hit too many good cards here. Or a 10 force, so yeah, even better. 19 base. I wish you didn't hit a lot of upgrades. I wish you didn't hit a lot of upgrades. I really wish you didn't hit a lot of upgrades. Man. Man, why did your board, like, triple in strength the turn we fought you? Your board was trashed last turn, why did you just hit everything? He hit Polaris, double heaven hex, uh, maxed out Dance of the Dragonfly the turn we fight him? Okay, alright. If he doesn't hit everything, we're probably fine there. We're actually really, really close to being fine. 
That's weird. This is weird. Still don't hear what I'm looking for. It's fine. Charging waves max is cool. Vast universe for a million now. I need the last bit of that. We died in one turn, anyways. Should be a better expender than soul cleaving here. Oh, especially if we upgrade it. Okay. Yeah, I don't think this board is optimally sequenced. I was just going through some stuff real quick. But we're pretty well covered right now. Yeah, it's very nice to have the playlist back. Yeah, yeah, no, we, we were super covered. Interesting. When you have alternate art in Tangle, you get alternate art Devour as well. I didn't know that. That's really, really cool. That's actually really, really cool. I love that. There's even more force cap. This is getting wild. This is actually getting crazy. Um, We're just short of the chi to do this. We could do this. And that'll work. We're in four kill. Possible turn four kill. Um, I think I have to Entangling Agent Vine her. A Devouring Agent Vine. I don't think I can afford to drop in tempo at all. I need Inch Force so badly. Yeah, I need Inch Force so badly. Do I have an ad incentive? Uh, I don't even have ads turned on on my end. Any ads you're seeing is just Twitch pre-roll. I'm not sure what you mean by an ad incentive. I, I specifically have ads turned off on my end. Okay, we top four. Virtual. Never craning, we just don't have space for it. Um, Box of Cripple is great, but I just need tempo. I don't think we can ever even space spiritual at this point. I just need tempo. Very happy what we want. Just do this again. This worked pretty well. So it's one, two, three, four, five, essentially. Otherwise, we get Entangling Ancient Vine. 
but she just she doesn't look like she's surviving that, and I'm pretty sure she's not killing us before that. It is really unfortunate we never found Inch Force, which is the real payout. We shouldn't be doing... We You realize we're doing this much damage off of a level 2 Vigorous Force, and we're still playing Mountain Cleaving? Like, we're supposed to be doing Crash Footwork Inch Force stuff to just nuke. Or even, even sometimes not Crash fo a Footwork and just have this be Inch Force and then just Overwhelming Force, but... We're just... We're kind of missing... Um, once you hit a certain viewer threshold, Twitch will offer you lumps of money to Red X. I, I don't have anything like that, but I also probably wouldn't do that right now. I'm still looking to grow the stream rather than make money off the stream. It's it's definitely a passion and a hobby for me. I'd rather not uh, lose viewers by running ads as opposed to uh, getting, uh, getting a bit of extra income. Once we hit a certain point, I'll definitely sell out. Wow. Wild, wild draws. Wild draws. And we're never catching the speed. Yeah, but it's, it's those like, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. That's got to be so much better, right? This is 60% more base damage, but this is double the force. That has to be so much better. That has to be so much better. And now we can slam this and it always hits this for even more. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Whereas if we do... One, two, three, four. That's gotta be good enough, right? That's gonna kill through weekend, I'm pretty sure. Uh, this is even better right now, right? Yeah, no, no critique to the people who are, like, literally making their money off of, off of, um, running these ads. Like, I, I know a lot of smaller streamers who can just barely make this be a full-time job off of, off of running those ads. I have, I have no, uh, no qualms against them doing their thing, but... I've got a full-time job right now. I I don't think I need to switch to that yet. This is so much damage. I'm really impressed with this force board. Whatever plant we find, it's immediately maxed. Well... We didn't find a good plant, but it would have been immediately maxed. What's the variation? Don't even need the smash defense here. Yeah. Not worrying about it. Uh, we're just killing, right? I think this is killing through dive. It's last round, whatever we're doing. I could entangle her. Entangle is probably too good not to run here. Slows us down by another turn, but it slows her down by two turns. I'm going to change all cards in hand. Sure. What do you got? Last round, anyways. Have some fun with it. Slot 1 Entangle is so dirty. Slot 1 Entangle is so dirty. <laughs> I love it. I mean, I hate it when it gets played against me, but just the fact that she can is so crazy. Damage. So much damage. We. Uh, Skirmisher is way easier to play. That was a really cool game. 